After four highly exciting district events here in Israel, we are heading to the Israeli District Championship. It will take place in Jerusalem and will feature the top 45 Israeli teams, two of which won both their events this season and an additional eight have one win under their belt. Let's take a look at five of these teams, starting with my first lock, Team 6090 Orbit. They won ISR 1 and 3, they have the fourth highest EPA in the world and the highest in Israel. They are one of my favorites out there in the world so far this season, and I would really be surprised if they will not win this event. They are fast, they are smooth, they score like crazy, and um, it's really hard to take your eyes off them. Um, but one very good reason to do so is looking at my second lock for this event, and it's their ISR1 M3 Partners in Crime Team 3339 Bumblebee. They have the ninth PPA score in the world and the second one in Israel. They also have a great bot that can easily win this event. Um, they also won the Engineering Inspiration Award in District 3, which I think really shows how well-rounded this team really is and how strong they can be. Moving on to some contenders, starting with Team 1574 Miskar. Um, this is another top-tier team. They have the fourth highest TPA in Israel. Um, they are the ISR event three finalists. Um, I think uh, looking at the districts, they have a pretty strong trap and endgame. And one thing that I think they could have improved on during this time, and I honestly believe that they did so, is their auto and kind of working on that. And I'm convinced they're going to show up to this event with one that is so much better. My second contender for this event is Team 5951 Makers Assemble or MA. Um, they are ISR1 finalists and they made it to match 13 as Alliance 2 captains in ISR2, which is also something I would like to highlight. Um, basically, this team did both ISR1 and ISR2 events. And if you know how events work here in Israel, it basically means they did two events non stop. It's all happening in a matter of four days pretty much which is a tough thing to do these competitions are intensive so i definitely think being able to perform at such level doing this is it it really shows um the strength of this team and how great they are this season and i really hope it will go well for them in this event finally for my dark horse for this event i have team 6057 almost said they're one of the older teams here in israel um and i feel like they had a few rough years lately um their last blue banner was back in 2010 um, but this year I kind of feel like they're on a, some sort of a comeback. They made it all the way to matches 9 and match uh, 13 in their district events. Um, they have the 5th EPA score overall in Israel so far. Um, so I definitely think they're a team to uh, pay attention to watch for. I think they can go really far in this event. Um, so I highly recommend you check them out, check previous games, uh, check them in this event as well, obviously. And yeah, uh, good luck to all of the team competing in this event. Uh, it was really hard for me to pick, so we're definitely looking at a great competition. I can't wait. Um, I invite you all to join us. Uh, we're going to start qualifications in, on Wednesday at around 11.30 a.m. local time. Um, and let us know what you think about these picks. Support funds content creators when you sign up for a membership on YouTube Join. You'll get access to special perks like emotes, loyalty badges, and fund members will even get early access to our scheduled videos and more. 100% of this revenue will go back to our correspondents to help recognize their efforts. Click the Join button in any YouTube video to pledge your support.